Back here at home, a special summit today in downtown Detroit aimed at tackling an important issue. The Black Men in Leadership Summit looks to encourage and lift up the next generation to careers in the boardroom. And as our Evron Cassidy shows us, some big names were on hand to do just that. So we've heard a lot about diversity, equity and inclusion in the past couple of years, especially. But today's event took that a step further, encouraging black men to become successful leaders, board members and CEOs. Today is an important day for the future of black men in our country. This group of nearly 350 people make up their second annual Black Men in Leadership Summit. We wanted to be able to create something that is going to not only enlighten our community about the roles that black men really play in our country, in our homes, in our communities, but also about why it's important from a succession planning perspective to advance them in this country. The event was created by the Michigan Diversity Council with the goal of encouraging the next generation of black male leaders in the workforce and changing the narrative of black men in America. And the narrative around um, black men being fathers and being philanthropists and their give back to communities. We don't hear that part as much as we should. We've got to keep the focus on the greatness of black men manifesting our integrity, our dignity, our decency, and our courage, but especially our willingness to serve the least of these. Philosopher and social activist Dr. Cornell West was the keynote speaker. We also heard from a company president who admits his boardroom lacks diversity. How does that, that make you feel? And what do you do? Frustrated. Yeah. Frustrated. Yeah, embarrassed. I think there's a huge opportunity for us to, to, through allyship and through advocacy. He's here to change that now. One of them is to have diverse pipelines for our organization to continue to move people up to the highest levels of our organization. And again, this is an event that is going to continue every single year, encouraging the next leaders of tomorrow today. In Detroit, Evrod Kasame, Local 4. Thank you, Evrod. By the way, you too can get involved in the Michigan Diversity Council. For more information on their next Black Men in Leadership Summit or details on future events, we posted a link on our website. Just go to clickondetroit.com.